I'm Chris Cherentusky, Executive Vice President and Director of the Chicago Botanic Garden. The agave, or century plant, is finally blooming in the arid greenhouse. In fact, it's blooming right through the greenhouse roof. The scientific name is Agave Americana, and it's called the century plant because it blooms sporadically. Some plants, like iris or peonies, will bloom every spring or every fall, but people notice that this plant flowers sometimes. People thought it flowered every hundred years. Agave is a monocarpic plant, which means that it flowers once, sets seeds, and then dies, which also means this plant is in its final stages of its life. We estimate it is probably about 10 to 15 years old. In warmer climates, these plants bloom when they are 10 years old. In cooler climates, they bloom when they are about 35 years old. And this plant is an amazingly designed plant. If you look at the base of the plant close up, it has about 20 to 40 leaves. The leaves are covered with a waxy coating, and all the water for the plant gets stored in the leaves. The leaves are long-lasting and grow in a rosette to catch water and funnel it to the bottom of the plant. They'll last maybe 10 to 15 years, whereas a maple will lose its leaves every winter. So the leaves are very important to the plant. Earlier, the leaves were standing pretty much upright. It was a very impressive plant. Now the leaves are pretty much sagging. When agaves flower and are getting ready to die, they produce pups at the base. If you look closely, you can see them at the base of this plant. And these pups are little offshoots of the plant. They will grow to form new rosettes of a plant that will grow and start all over again. The flower stalk is anywhere from 15 to 25 feet tall. It's called a panicle. It looks like a candelabra and it starts flowering from the bottom to the top. And this flowering process can take up to two months. It's an impressive plant. Its native range is centered in Mexico, although it's been spread around the world because it's such a beautiful landscape plant. It's used for landscaping often, and it's a great plant from the Americas. From up on the roof, you get a whole different viewpoint of the agave, or century plant. You can see here the stem has about 20 branches coming off of the main stem, and you can see the flowers open from the bottom to the top. You can see the light yellow flowers in the bottom area, and this will take quite a bit of time for it all to open up. It's an impressive sight, both from the bottom and from up on top here.